And we're back. Okay, so, um, mod changes. Right. I have uninstalled Bats Travel. Um, but why? Brilliant. I, I really think it's a great uh, mod, and I love the Bat Travel. But I'm a little worried that I'm just flying around using this fast travel, and it's going to make this Let's Play very, very short indeed. So, I just, for some reason, let me know what you think. I'm sort of, I'm open to maybe keeping it and only using it to get back to the castle or something. I, it, the thing is, is I quite like the idea of being able to travel using things like carriages, but you have to go somewhere to get to them. Uh, but with the bat thing, I can just literally walk out of a dungeon, go back here. Um, and, and it makes for less travel. Now, whilst that will make the game progress faster, it also it removes a lot of the side quests, well, well, what I used to do. Well, and, you know, where quite a lot of things used to happen. So I've removed it. It's, But I'm, I'm open to being convinced to put it back. Uh, so I don't know. I'm, I'm just torn on this issue. Obviously, I uninstalled Better Vampires last time because I I was getting some glitches. And anyway, I do want to try another of the vampire overhauls. And I installed Belua Sanguinaire Revisited, which is another massive overhaul. This one seems kind of... Um, it's very cool. They're all into the sort of original lore of vampires. So, for example, if I, if I enter a place I've not been invited, anywhere where you have to actually break the lock or something, you start taking damage, so, but you can then charm the owner of the house so that he invites you in and then you're okay. So I like little things like that, actually. I think that's kind of cool. It has levels, uh, Fledgling, Risen, Master, Progenitor, Sire, and they, as you go up in levels, you get new abilities and new disadvantages. Uh, I think it's similar to the stages, but I, I, not quite, actually. Because with the stages of hunger in the normal game, you get more powerful as you get new stages. But it's like you're getting more feral. In this, that doesn't seem to be the case. I mean, you become a, a master vampire. That doesn't sound very feral. And then you become a progenitor and then a sire. So, But they have also still got hunger. So you can be exceptionally hungry and a fledgling and so on. So they've se they seem to have separated them. So we're going to discover that. And the other mod that I've installed is the Vampire Lord, uh, what's it called? Revamped Vampire Lord, which uh, makes the Vampire Lord a little bit more powerful, at least the melee side of it. If you remember in the last episode, I was a little disappointed that, in actual fact, I did seem to do less damage and take more damage when I was a Vampire Lord than as Steve. As in my normal orc form like this, with a mace, I seem to be doing better. And seeing as this character is not a warrior character, this is this that's really bad. Um, so, you know, and the advantage of being in this form, of course, is I get all my spells and shouts and powers. So the only real thing about the Vampire Lord was the when you were flying and you got the, the grip spell, which was great, but again, I, I wanted something a little bit more. I wanted to be physically more impressive than just the basic orc here. So I've got, a, I've got a mod that increases that. I've got it on the lowest level. I have not taken it to the highest level, so it's not too overpowered. And we'll see how that is. It also comes with a small tweak to the collision when you're in vampire lord form. Uh, because I was getting sick of not being able to get through doors. And it does that by making the model a little smaller. Which is unfortunate, because I like the large model. But it's going to get frustrating if I can't go through doors. So, oh right! To start the Belua Sanguinaire Vampires, um, sort of, to start this mod off, you have to drink a potion that magically appears in your inventory. So we're going to drink that now. Awkward for you. Oh, okay. What was going to happen? You sense that you are satiated. Hey, oh, 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 oh. Oh, awesome. <laughs> oh, do it again, do it again. Right. So I've now been satiated. Now, I, I believe I'm supposed to have some sort of journal. Vampire's journal and vampire note. What's this? Oh, no, that's, that's the vampire note I picked up. Vampire's journal. Uh, okay, so I am now an orc fledgling. Um, and 
blah 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 blah. It gives me all the stats. My hunger level is currently satiated. I have no unique feeds. I have killed no one by feeding, and I have drained 0.00%. Okay, so as you can see, it gives you all the details you're going to... Good grief. Actually, this gives you a lot of details. Um, I may actually sit down and read this in, in great detail. I think it's similar to the PDF that comes with it, uh, which I have read. So, but again, this this mod is going to make me it makes the sun harm me, etc. So we're going to see how this behaves. Okay, so let's just get on with the game then. And we do have the continuation of our moth priest prophecy, which still cracks me up. And I need to command the moth priest to read the elder scroll. Oh, that's him. Okay, well, that was uh, fairly master. I have done as you asked and traveled here. Oh, oh, oh. Can I do that again? I want to hear the whole master. Master. Oh. <laughs> I have done as you asked and traveled here. Can you do that? I, I would like all my minions to do that from now on. It's not going to happen, is it? All right. Master, I have done as you asked and traveled here. Yes, yes. Now I have a new task for you. Of course. What is it that you need me to do? I'd like you to hop up down on one leg and put your finger in your nose. Or, alternatively, something a little less demeaning, I guess. Read the Elder Scroll. Ah, yes. The Elder Scroll. I admit, I am looking forward to this. Of course, <laughs> Master. Begin. I now, need to wave. If Ooh. everyone will please be quiet, I must concentrate. I s Excuse me a second. I want to be able to read this. Before, an image of a great bow. I know this weapon. It is Oriole's bow. Oriole's bow. Now a voice whispers, saying, Among the night's children, a dread lord will rise. In an age of strife, when dragons return to the realm of men, darkness will mingle with light. Night of the day will be as one. The voice fades and the words begin to shimmer and distort. But wait, there is more here. The secret of the bow's power is written elsewhere. I think there is more to the prophecy, recorded in other scrolls. Yes, I see them now. One contains the ancient secrets of the dragons, and the other speaks of the potency of ancient blood. My vision darkens. And I see no more. To know the complete prophecy, we must have the other two scrolls. Right, oh. Now, I've been told that one of those scrolls is the one I gave to the orc, um, and that I'm going to have to buy it back from him, which is most annoying, because I wasn't really selling him the scroll. I was giving my librarian, as the arc mage of the college, I was giving my librarian the scroll to keep for the college, ergo me. When he gave me the money it was a bit of a, you know, it's nice, but it wasn't necessary. Now I apparently I'm going to have to buy it back, and I bet you he's going to charge me a fortune, and then I'm going to seriously have to Reasons resist the urge to kill him. What do you need? Okay. That was not as useful as I would have liked. That was dead useful. Talked about Even a dreadlord. So you did well. Me? My traitor wife stole one of them away and then disappeared. So we need to As find for that. the other, the last that I heard, it was lost. Yes, the that's the one. Yeah, I've got that one. It seems our work is not yet done. But I have waited this long, and we are so very close now. I can wait a bit longer. All right. If you need anything, say the word. I can oh. still forge a decent blade. Can you feel it? You're now so much more than you were before. I'm was I could barely hold my own in the companions. Oh, you're in the companions? Now I could slaughter them all without a second thought. And I'm not half the vampire Lord Harkon is. Truth is, I'm better with a forge than I am with claws or fangs. Can I assist you? <sighs> Don't know, those companions are pretty tough. And werewolves I, as well. I was. Didn't progress very far. Never did care for their attitude, acting like they're better than everyone else. But none of that matters now. Hmm. Let's have a look. 
If there is one thing I know, it's weapons and armor. Show Take me. Look. Oh, I need a new outfit. I'm actually thinking of just crafting myself some ebony armor until I make a decision as to what... Oh, I don't have the ebony. Oh, I don't have the ebony crafting skill, do I? Actually, before I sell things, I'm going to go and see if I can disenchant anything. Until I'll be back. Time. Do you have a moment to talk? Um, well, yeah, but I, I want you some crafting and stuff. Do you have a moment to talk? <sighs> Fine. That moth priest, Dexian, he said we needed two other Elder Scrolls. Oh, yep. I think I know where we can start looking. Me too. We're quite a team, us, aren't we? Didn't want that lot getting wind of it, especially my father. All right. Ever since he decided to make that prophecy his calling, we kind of drifted apart. I don't even think he sees me as his daughter anymore. I'm just... a means to an end. Hmm. We need to find my mother, Valerica. She'll definitely know where it is. And if we're lucky, she actually has it herself. Uh, will she give it to us, though? The last time I saw her, she said that she'd go somewhere safe. Somewhere that my father would never search. Other than that, she wouldn't tell me anything. But the way she said it, someplace he would never search. It was cryptic, yet she called attention to it. Hmm. Um. Could be in the sun, I guess. Sunlight, some, somewhere he'd never... In a, in a church. Oh, right! One thing about this um, Bello, Bellua Sanguinaire revisited. Apparently, I take damage if I go near shrines. Um, so that's going to make some of those uh, shrine quests a little difficult to do. But uh, yeah, so I can't go near holy objects as well, which is also exceptionally cool. You sense that you are satiated. Thank you. Um, maybe your mother didn't trust you either. It's always a possibility. She was almost as obsessed as my father by the time she shut me in. But I she shut you in there? Now. It was your mother who did that? Scroll, and she's our only lead. Okay. Besides... I can't imagine a single place my father would avoid looking. And he's had all this time, too. Any ideas? Dawnguard, maybe? Right here in the castle. See, sealed away doesn't sound right, but hiding with the Dawnguard, it's a little a real obvious, but yeah, maybe. Wait, that almost makes sense. I used to help my mother tend a garden in the courtyard here. All of the ingredients for our potions came from there. She used to say that my father couldn't stand the place. Too... peaceful. <laughs> oh, absolutely. But my mother's not a coward. That is, I don't think we'll actually trip over her there, but it's worth a look. Yeah, definitely. Trust me, I lived here a very long time and I know every nook and cranny. There's an unused inlet on the northern side of the island that was used by the previous owners to bring supplies into the castle. An old escape tunnel from the castle exits there. I think that's our way in. Fine. Don't let me stand in your way. Yeah, I want to do some things. I'll be at the dock when the, I... The, um... Project Reality Lighting mod, it's, um... It's pretty good, actually. Definitely the lighting is more realistic inside. Definitely. All right, let's go do see what crafting and enchanting. Oh, your arms off. Shut up. Simple, isn't it? Um, enchanting, enchanting. Let's disenchant things first. Hello. Did you will be a welcome addition to the court, I'm sure. If I may, let me offer you a piece of advice. You may. Be careful who you trust. Not all of us have the court's best interests at heart. But of course you Orthiof, do. Orthiof, for example. He'll tell you he means well, but believe me, he can't be trusted at all. Keep that in mind, will you? Oh, absolutely, yes, yes. He claims to serve loyally, but he really covets the throne. He sees himself in charge someday. <laughs> the His arrogance of it. Will justify any How dare actions. he think he's going to have the throne Your before me? Faith in him, and you will regret it. I promise you. Speak with Fura Bloodmouth. She has something for you. Hmm. Huh? <laughs> Need anything, Baron? Nah, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> no, I 
Let's stop this no, dude. I don't need anything right now. Please stop asking. Yes, of course. Okay, anything to disenchant? Elven mace of. You see, it's a mace. It is a mace. I could use it. It paralyzes, but I want that enchantment. And I, I would like a better mace. Elven, for all, for God's sake. Elven. Ew. Everything else cannot be disenchanted, or I've already disenchanted something similar. So. Politics bore me terribly, but they're a fact of life here. Okay. Speak with Fura Bloodmouth. She has something for you. All right. You'd be surprised what people leave behind when you burn their <laughs> to the ground. Absolutely. Love it. Brilliant. Anything... Well, he didn't have a lot of money, did he? All Who right, are you? I hope you find life in the castle to I need to your liking. I need training in speech. Actually, I'd like, to, I'd like to improve my speech a little bit, to be honest. Um, it's it's one of the things I've always seen Steve, even though he doesn't seem like a diplomat. Um, I think of him as being a commanding presence, at least he thinks of himself that way. He should be able to speak to people and say, do my bidding. So I'm actually going to, I'm going to, I've not done any training. Of course, it is my duty to serve and I'm happy to do it. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, I'm quite a talker now. Oh! All right. Huh? Oh, I, I hate this interface. Have you noticed this? I clicked on the one up here. You've I know. Done well. I need more practice. Done well. You mean I would finally be able to whistle for my horse? Of course. <laughs> hey, excellent. Maybe that option will disappear now. Right. Is so good. Whatever is required. I'm happy to do whatever is asked of me. I only wish to be useful. God, you're a bit of a. Often I take on tasks that Garen kiss or ass, aren't you, really? tasteful, or. Beneath them, if I can remain useful, those above me will see fit to keep me here. Oh, dude, stop it. I'm That's sorry, revolting. I don't have more to offer. Let's have a look. Nope. Not really. Any spells, maybe? Maybe? Necromantic healing. This is a heal them dead. Right, this is what I want. Heal undead. I'm going to need that for, um, yeah, for healing my vampires. Can I heal myself? No. Raise zombie. All right, good, good, good. That is, that is useful. Until next time. Where is Serana? Is she not following me anymore? Powerful allies, is it not? Hmm. Okay. Apparently not following me anymore. All right, that's probably everything I need from her. I. So what can I actually make? Oh, I can even take the stuff from here. That's kind of nice. Never made it far in the companion. Oh, bef before I do that, let's uh, put on my glass gauntlets of Ow. smithy. Someone else is using this. Right, what can I make? What can I make? Dragon? No, orcish. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, is the orcish armor looks pretty cool, actually. Hmm. It's... It's definitely an option. It, I think... The thing is, is I just... I feel I need to get rid of the, um... The furs now. I really do feel like I need to get rid of the fur and put on something cleaner and a bit more sophisticated. So I think I'm going to do that. Okay, one of the things I can make now is a preservation jar. Um, which is a hermetically sealed fresh, uh, sorry, it hermetically seals fresh useful hearts, preserving them from rot and decay. Apparently when I kill people, I can actually rip their hearts out and eat them. But if I've got these jars, I can actually keep them for a while. But I need fire salts. I want to make at least one of these. I do need fire salts. Well met, brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to have got a quest. <laughs> But yeah, I don't really need to do those quests. I'd rather have these jars. Never I'm gonna make, companions. I'm gonna make some more later on once I figure I out how useful they are. But it's nice to have one, so I can save them. Because apparently healing potions and stuff don't work as well on me anymore, which um, is obviously not as not as useful. But I can eat people's hearts, which is very gruesome. <laughs> yeah, I mean it's 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 not quite. 
what I had in mind for it, but it's a little less rustic. So I don't know. What do you guys think? I think I need some better armor. I don't know. I've seen a few things like the Nemesis armor and stuff, but they require perks that I just don't have yet. But is this, for a vampire lord, is this a little bit more... Oh, I'll tell you what I'm going to do, though. I'm going to take off those pouches. I'm going to stick everything back in. That's not bad, is it? Vaguely scary. Okay. So, all right. I've put the cloak back on. It's not too bad with this armor. It's a little less rustic. So the, the, the cloak and this armor is actually not too bad a mix. And I feel slightly more refined. Okay. So. Let's chat to Fura Bloodmouth. Um, no, I do not want to feed on her. <laughs> New blood, eh? Can I feed on Let's other vampires? Get something very clear. I don't care about politics. You want to fight over the throne with the rest of them, go right ahead. I feed when I'm hungry, I sleep when I'm tired, and I kill whenever I'm in the mood. Those are the things that are important to me. Okay, it's fairly clear. Simple. He says kill, I kill. Oh, I want you to work for me. <laughs> Sometimes. He doesn't even have to say it. I so want you to come work for me. A bunch of feral vampires are running wild, upsetting the mortals. When the prey is riled, it makes things difficult for us. Go cull the brutish beasts before the problem gets out of hand. Ah, all right. Kill a bunch of other vampires. What time of day is it? It is uh, daytime, so I need to sleep, I believe. But before I do, I'm going to find... Where is Serena? Now, with Serena, if I, if I talk to her, I have to do her quest, so... Probably... Probably Many something I should avoid doing. No, oh, no, I've already drained you of all your money. All right, I miss Jizargo. I'm giving some serious thought to going back to Whiterun and picking up Jizargo. He won't mind me being a vampire. Jizargo loves me. Just uh, going to do some feeding. Hello. Your vampiric powers recede as you feed. Alright, BSR feed. Right, so this BSR feed, that's the... Bellua Sanguinaire Revisited feed. And I'm assuming that is... the one I need for the special extra powers get my stats up. You sense that you are satiated. <laughs> See, these are just normal. My vampiric powers f as I receive. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I should only feed on sleeping people or paralyze people. Right, so I fed on a lot of people now. So, if I look at my vampire journal, does it tell me this? I've had three daily unique feeds. So I've only had three BSR feeds. That's the key here. So the normal feeds don't affect these stats. There is a way of getting rid of those feeds, I believe. Um, by using... Oh, wait a minute. If the, I'm not using the, the optional ESP that gives you the vampire race. Now, which looks really cool, actually, because apparently what it does is it makes you really pale. Um, so, but there may be some problems with Dawn Guard, so he recommended not, the mod author recommended not using it, I think. Which is a shame, because I'd like to look really pale. But he did say that um, you will get two feed options. So, alright, so now I've fed, then I go and sleep. I wish Orthiolt and Vingama would just get it over with him. Not you. Rest. Seven o'clock at night, perhaps? What do you think? Eight hours? <laughs> Sleeping in a coffin. It's very cool. But apparently to progress to the next level, when I've ki killed enough people to progress to the next level, I have to actually sleep for a full 24 hours. Oh, perhaps I don't. 
sense that you are... S you. Ooh, okay, let's have a look at my new powers. Do I have new powers? Oh, I believe I actually have to... Um, I have to sleep just to get all my basic powers. So, right. Oh, yeah, I've got horse whistle now. So I can now whistle for my horse. Excellent. And convenient horses. I should set that up for my new horses. Berserker Age. Why isn't that on my favourites? Right. Allows you to conceal your identity when you are hungered. Right. Apparently, with this mod, if I get really hungry, um, people start getting aggressive towards me because they can tell I'm a vampire. This allows me to hide that. Oh, right. And there's a um, summoned helper to do your uh, settings with. Okay. We don't need to do that at the moment. I'm quite happy with... I don't actually have a huge amount of vampire powers. Are there any other vampire spells? Oh, spells! Thank you for reminding me. Heal undead. Wait a minute. I thought I bought two spells. Obviously not. Right. Let's go kill some vampires. I really want to go sort of swing by and pick up Jizargo. It just It's just not the same. But at the same time, I sort of want to do these... Um, the Dawn Guard quests with... Oh! That is a living creature. What is he doing here? Alright. Question. Why is she out here? a way to rip his heart out. I can, I can see red things here. I can see red things here. I thought I was supposed to be able to... Oh, I'm missing something, aren't I? Is it a power? Is it a power? No. Oh! How annoying. Because I honestly... I, th I heard his heartbeat. I did. I heard his heartbeat. Damn. There's another one. Oh, he's in there. Oh, he's up the top. Alright, let's go get him. You're immune to my buffs. However, is this person immune to my fear? Somehow I doubt it. I should be able to I should be able to bite them. You know what? Victory is yours. I submit. And I definitely don't want the vampire sight, but what do I want? Oh vampiric grip. <laughs> ah. By the way, do I take fall damage as a, a lord? Did, th did I just get a bounty for that? It said um, gained and received from Whiterun. Alright, where did that corpse go? After I flung him off. Alright, I guess he was the last, um, last person alive to see me transfer... Transform into a vampire lord. You gotta admit, that's a very cool way to kill people. Oh, wait a minute. Drain life force. Dark sacrifice. What's dark sacrifice? Oh, it's one of the new. It's one of the new. Um... Oh, I got that pause again. Somebody told me that that pause in the animation has nothing to do with better vampires. But I, it stopped occurring when I got the. 
when I removed Better Vampires, but it's back now that I've installed Bellowa Sang... that one. BSR. So I'm wondering if it's just something that occurs if I've got too many scripts running, especially in the vampire thing. I'm ready if you are. Let's go. No. Don't let me stand in your way then. Are you going to be joining you me though? Dock whenever you're ready. I'm sort of tempted to do that first. And then go and kill those vampires. Anyway, what was I saying? You know what I was thinking? Rather than go and get Jazago, will it let me recruit one of the doggies now? You! Woof woof! Come with me. I, I don't have an animal with me. I don't have any followers. I have zero followers. None. Not a one. Oh, right, yeah, so anyway, Jizago. It, it isn't, is it? Let's face it, Let's Play is not the same without Jizago. But I have a feeling that if I take Jizago or Janessa, you know, basically, these the Dawnguard quests are going to be too simple. I think they're too low level for my current level. Um, so I'm sort of tempted to do them alone and take Seren Serana as well because she's part of the quests. But generally, do it alone. Which is just, I don't know, it feels wrong. Good grief, just had one of those uber long loading screens. I did also notice that uh, I had leveled up, hadn't I? So what can I have now? Uh, still Magicka at the moment, I think. I'm... Uh, in need. Conjuration. I so want. Oh, it's a tough call, this one. Because my illusion is really getting up there. I can't quite get expert illusion yet. That's the one I want, isn't it? And quiet casting. You know what? I'm going to take that. I am going to take that, because I am I'm really determined to use more of these sort of illusion rage spells, and I want I found a mod that gives a dominate spell as well. I'm going to have that. So, right. Right, here we go. What does this say anything? That's the five stages of vampirism. No, all right. Um, I've got the PDF uh, for BSR on my tablet, and uh, I I am unsatiated. So I've got to I've got to check that out as to why it was I did not get the option to take that man's beating heart out of his chest, which would have been exceptionally cool. Right. So let's just see two quests. Sculling the Beast and Scroll Scouting. Buy back the Elder Scroll. You see, this is the buy back. I didn't want a tooth. I should go and cave his skull in. Seeking disclosure. Either. Speak to Serana. Rising at dawn. Speak to... Don't care about that. Right. So. Gulling the Beast. Where is that? Eh. Yeah. Right, so I need to get to Windhelm, Windhelm, and Winterhold. Oh, do you know what? I keep saying I'm going to do this quest. I am. I'm going to do that quest. Word of power. So, here. Right. Hoofing it time! There's nothing I want here. I definitely need a horse and carriage mod here. Something that'll take me to solitude. This is... Is there anything there? No. Oh, wait a minute. Travel to Icewater Jetty. Somebody told me there was another... Um, another way of travelling, like boats, to, to Windhelm. To the castle. I don't see it. Does anyone see it? They probably lied to me. Ooh. 
What on earth is that? How random. Yeah, I, I thought there was a boat or something that I could take to Windhelm. But I was mistaken. So, huffing it time. Let's huff it. See, this is where you start regretting uh, removing the the bat spell. Now, I get faster sprinting, apparently, with this um, BSR mod. So that should be interesting. Let's make sure I've got Vampire Sight. And what, what powers do I actually have? I now have my horse. Oh, I've got my horse whistle. I've got horse whistle. And I have that on my... Now, apparently this is different to the um, to the horn. So the horse now comes running rather than getting teleported. Perhaps he needs to be actually semi-close to me. God, that vampire... Tell you what, with the darker nights, I'm, the vampire sight is not strong enough. With Project Reality Darker Nights, is it? I need to tweak it for sure. It is so easy to get lost here. I tell you what, two things. One, the darkness, I think, for Project Reality is a tiny bit too dark for video making still. Um, I mean, I can't activate my vampire sight when I'm on horseback, and it, if I get off, That's alright. But I've also noticed that for some reason I got a message saying, I don't know, you're you're hungry. And I'm um I seem to have detect life. I wonder if that's part of BSR. That when I get hungry, I um unfortunately Well not unfortunately, I start to detect life. I say that actually no, I do mean unfortunately, because I, I don't want detect life on all the time. I'm going to turn that off. I mean, I probably should just try and make sure I'm not hungry. But I seem to be getting hungry rather fast. Um, so, yeah. Oh, the other thing I noticed, uh, I've had is a couple of freezes. I've stopped the video for a part of that journey because I got a couple of freezes. Um, so, I think it's related to how many mods I've got installed. Skins as pale as the snow. Need a ride? Yeah. Where do you want to go? Uh, Windhelm for now. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Windhelm's a bit cool for my tastes. So yeah, I'm actually thinking that the more scripts I'm running, the more likely I am to have that sort of freeze for. I mean, sometimes it can be like five, ten minutes. It can be even. It can even be so long that I have to uh, shut down the game. So I'm actually thinking that it's to do with scripted mods, and these vampire overhaul mods are all about scripted. What? What? What's? What's that? I've got blood leaking out of me. That can't be good, can it? What? What? <laughs> Vampire's journal. Um. It is currently on the sunset. Sunset is okay. Sunset is, you know, vampirism still fledgling. Hunger level starving. All right, so I am starving. That seems to be really fast. Really fast that I'm starving. However, I think this means that because I'm starving, they can see me. Which means I need to use Sumo Mortalis Forma. And now I've got little green things around me. Which should mean nothing will attack me. Yeah, you see I'm detecting... I am detecting life, aren't I? And I've not told it to do that. Tell me you've seen them. Those things. Small and evil like something else. So I need to find some victims. I need to sneak up on some victims and feed on them. 
So let's map updated. Whoa, 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 whoa. Map updated with what? How weird. Okay. So let's. Where is my vampire? Oh, oh right. You know what? While I'm in what was what is it called? Sumo mortalis forma. I don't get my vampire skills. I guess. Please tell me I get them back. Okay. That's not going to be good. That is yeah. Oh, I do. But oh, it That's unfortunate because what it basically does there is it uh, it resets your favorites on the vampire skills that you lost, I guess. I might have to do some configuration here. Oh. I still have that one selected. Okay, there's my vampire site. And what else do I need? Do you know what I'm going to do? I've got invisibility. I want muffle. I need to find someone to feed upon. Now, apparently I can sneak up on people. And feed on them. As long as I'm not seen by anyone. Else. Now, if I enter people's houses to feed on the sleeping... What time is it? Probably isn't late enough. If I do that, unfortunately, I start taking damage, I believe, because uh, I've not been invited in, which is equally cool. Could you two go away so I can feed on this uh, gentleman? I'm cancelling the sight because I'm not totally sure what will happen if I feed whilst my vision's on. Sneak feed. Oh, what? Oh, right. It would seem there's a chance of failing sneak feed. Must be my imagination. God, I hope he's uh, not aggressive now. Okay. Yeah, that's uh, that's unfortunate. I completely. Even think about it. I'm not going to. I wasn't going to. Honestly, I wasn't going to. Apparently, some Nord women were murdered. Not sure why. Oh, uh, so oh, it's way too dark. Just have to know. What is your scene? <laughs> Needs another drink. My, I'll be right here. My what now? No one's sleeping. No one's sleeping. I need to find somewhere where, where people are sleeping and boots? feed fairly quickly. However, I don't seem to be getting attacked. I thought I'd be getting attacked on sight as a vampire. You need anything? I'm a dark elf and I live in Windhelm. So yes, I live in the Grey Quarter. You must be new around here. Or you'd know they don't let my kind live anywhere outside that slump. <laughs> right, that wasn't a helpful Take conversation. Care. I'm a sailor on the North Wind. We're laying over in Windhelm for a while. I need... S Are there any beggars? That's the one thing in Oblivion. I could always find beggars. What? Um, that would be a uh, hostile guard. Oh, what? Please. Do I have a bounty in Windhelm now? So guards, guards are hostile to you, but not... Oh. 
God, this is this is actually really painful. So I've got to really watch and make sure I feed at regular intervals. And I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm definitely going to... See, now I'm not registered as a vampire, so hopefully he should ignore me. I don't get any vampire don't skills. Hindsgrove. Why? Why there? There's no place safe. Looking to hire a boat? Where are you headed? Ah, right, here we go. High Rock. That's, that's home, isn't it? That would be really useful. I'm going to come back here and use it. I'm assuming it's there. And then I'll find the boat to fast travel from there. That's very useful. Farewell. Uh, probably nothing else. I, I so very, very, very need, very need, oh dear. English. Do you speak it? I need to feed. Yeah, this mod definitely gives um, gives you a lot of problems as a vampire, which is good. I mean, this is this is it should be being a vampire should not be trivially easy. So I'm going to have to really focus on keeping myself well fed. But for now, I need to find someone who is asleep and feed on them because the Imagine blowing up an entire town. You sense that you're starved of blood. I know, I know, I know, I know. The... To see you again, um, there is a chance of being detected when you try to feed on sneak, sneaked opponents. And it's based upon your sneak, which mine is terrible. And on your pickpocket. And mine also is terrible for that. Oh, temple. Don't go in there. All right. Could there be sleeping people in here? Do people sleep in the beds here? This is an ode to Skyrim's truest sons and daughters, the Stormcloaks. We drink to our youth, to the days come and gone. For the age of is Neil's going to sleep? Is now nearly done. We'll drive out the empire. Right, let's have a look. So let's wait a couple hours. Let's see if we can find a victim. <laughs> and our steel we will take St I know, I'm starved of blood. I know, I know. No, no one's coming to sleep. To oh, stop singing. You're, You're keeping everyone awake. Yeah, Sing something sleepy. We drink and we sing. We're the oh, stop singing. Can you sing a lullaby? They're not going to sleep. No one's coming to bed. Oh, what? Right. The palace. The palace. I can enter the palace, can't I? Yes, I can enter the palace. And feed on Ulfric. Because that shouldn't be considered uh, private property. <laughs> I don't need to be invited in. Ulfric won't give us a straight answer. Okay, okay, okay. Find someone. Okay, yeah, that... That looks like a sleeping person. Right, let's get some. Wait a minute. Yes. Muffle. Oh, my, re my magic is not regenerating. Why is my magic not regenerating? What? Oh, no. Oh, is this part of the... I might this because I'm suffering. Restoration spells are only 66% effective on you. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Um, but I seem to be not regenerating at all. Weaker to attacks from combatants carrying garlic or use... Oh, that's right. If I try and attack anyone with silver or garlic, I get in trouble as well. And I should not carry any garlic of my own. Let's double check I'm not. <laughs> I 
Alright, no garlic, that's good. But no um, visibility, which is uh, annoying, because my... Let's have a look. Alright. Oh! No, what? Why can't I feed off him? Oh, please let me feed off him, come on. No, what? Really? I can't feed off him? Oh, come on. There's no one in there. I don't have to detect life on anyone. Oh, what? Oh, that's um really unfortunate because I'm just running out of magic now. I'm I'm just completely. <sighs> I do the cooking oh, and cleaning. Oh, don't want to talk to you. Don't want to talk to you. You'll talk to me. Just can't feed off him. Oh, oh, world's most annoying situation. And let them die with their bullshit. I'm lost. Okay. We've been soldiers a lot. What? I'm in combat. Why am I in combat? Oh, my sumo mortalis dropped. Oh, I'm so very, very dead, aren't I? Oh, God. <laughs> You're kidding me. Oh, you are so kidding me. I am so out of here. I've used the power, I've used the power. I guess it doesn't matter if you use the power in front of people. <laughs> oh, you're kidding me. I can't regenerate magica. I can't, I can't, oh, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Oh, I can't jump that way. No, oh, go away, go away, go away, go away. Um... I am so dying. Do I have any stamina? I have, yes, yes. Let's just use... Oh. I don't suppose you'd take me away, would you? No, probably not. <laughs> Crying out loud. That is me thinking that being a vampire would not be all about being cool and visiting young maidens' bedchambers. Okay. Uh, oh, wait. The reason I couldn't feed was... Oh, I'm such an idiot. I've got to get the hang of this. I had, um... I had Sumo Mortalis Former up. And of course, you can't... Oh, right. Oh, God, that's... <sighs> this is going to take a lot of getting used to. This really is going to take a lot of getting used to. So, um, you don't have enough magic, of course you don't. And I should start taking damage almost immediately. But I'm going to drop. And now I should be able to feed. I should be able to feed. Yes! Oh, thank you. Oh. Oh. Alright, um... I didn't want to kill her. I mean, I'm not completely against it. Fresh heart added. Alright. Um, yeah, sorry about that. Do you have anything else I can steal while I'm at it? <laughs> okay. Oh, thank God for that. Oh my God. Oh. 
Do I stop taking damage because the owner of the house is dead? Um, she resurrected. Oh, so she becomes my servant after I, um... Well, that's interesting. I still seem to be taking damage. One of your damaged hearts has disintegrated. I've only had it for like half a second. I didn't have it for very long. Oh. I've even got that jar. I don't even know where the jar is. Destroyed heart. Can I eat it? Damage health discovered from destroyed heart. No, I can't eat it. Uh, let's have a look. What else have I got? Oh. Okay. This is going to take quite a lot of getting used to, isn't it? Right. Hunger level. Fammy. I'm still famished. I'm still famished. I'm still. F oh, you're kidding me. Okay. I'm. Ha I'm. I'm. Hunger level. Famished. Um. Oh, of course. Now I have to go back to my powers and re-put that on. No. Okay. Right, we're going to have to break into someone else's house and... Now, are the, are the guards hostile to me still? Or can I get away? Can I get in now? Right. I'm famished, but they're not chasing me down. Let's go and take someone else. We've got to, we've got to feed. Got to feed. Good God. Alright, what else? Let's go to the rich section. I feel like an expensive meal. Whew. Oh, I've got something to return here as well. I'll do that later. No, no, I just, I just cast open mass that didn't last long enough. All right, now I'm gonna start taking damage again. So let's one person. Okay. What? What was that? You sense that you are hungry. Have I already taken that person then? Right. I should watch my uh, vampire thermal vision when feeding. Alright, well I didn't kill that person, so that's probably good. One more up there. And one there. Unsatiated. Satiated. Is there anything better than satiated? Probably not. Okay, so I have got to seriously feed a lot and often. Oh my god. Okay. Well, that was a bit, uh, difficult. 